The Climate Initiative's resources are outstanding, really easy to use. This ranks up with some of the best professional development that's been out there for decades. I'm walking away so impressed, so inspired, and I hope to grab a slot next year because I want to come back. So the first year, we only had seven teachers come to our National Teachers Retreat, and this year we had 57. So we have grown exponentially in the past three years. I am a homeschool parent. I teach at a cooperative. So I was looking for resources and community. I think the Climate Initiative is a great opportunity for any educator. And I am a New York City public school teacher and I teach high school math. The learning labs are fantastic. Having teachers who've been teaching for decades discuss ways that they have implemented some of these tools in their classroom, charts and graphs, ones that I could peg to the high school math standards that I am expected to present to students. The network and the engagement and the connections that I've made here have been invaluable and I would recommend it to any teacher in any discipline. I always feel learning about our earth is the most important thing. I tell my students, if you don't have a place to live on, can you exist? Coming to these events helps me to understand how to do it in different locations and different areas globally and teach it to my students from local to global. We all have different experiences, perspectives, and perceptions, and they all matter, and we want to come together and to support that. And there's something unique about bringing educators together and having that energy and that intensity. You have a support group, and you have people that you can turn to for more information, more ideas, and, and support just when it gets hard. And so this, to me, is a space where teachers can come and learn from each other, learn from us, and then leave feeling like they have an entire group of friends that they can depend on in the future as they're trying to address climate change in their communities.